All right, Monday night, seven new week here. First sale of the week, uh, Byron Brown 1968 tops. Sold this for $1.99, shipped on eBay. All right, Tuesday night here, I had a sale on Tuesday. It's a 1971 Catfish Hunter coin. Sold this for $14.99, shipped on eBay, which was full ask. All right, Friday morning here, just getting back from some traveling for work. Had a couple sales where I was going. Provided blue here, it's like a 1980s Pacific, I think it is. $1.99 shipped on eBay. Vic Davalilo, 1968 tops. Another one was $1.99 shipped on eBay. Jim Palmer accepted an offer. Uh, actually, this one sold, I think, for full ask at $39.99 shipped on eBay. Maybe $35. I can't remember. Um, the Gus Dorner, this one sold for full ask on eBay, $99.99 shipped. And then this one sold on my slabs, the Mini Minoso 1962 Post SGC5, sold for $40 shipped on my slabs. All right, a couple sales here to close out the week. We got a Steve Carl, oh, I'm sorry, Steve Carlson. Robin Yacht 1991 tops. This one sold for $275, shipped on eBay. Uh, here's a Steve Carlton. Had this list for $20, except it off for $16, shipped on eBay. Last but not least, a bigger sale yesterday. Uh, this is a 1965 tops. Tony Oliva, short print. PSA 8 had a list for $550, except it off for $480, shipped on eBay. All right, it's Monday, start of a new week here. Got the first sale of the week. 1955 tops Johnny Padres SGC 3.5 had it listed for $35 on eBay except it enough for $30 shipped on eBay all right Tuesday morning had another sale here 1912 2207 brown back round Olaf Hendrickson CSG 1.5 had this listed for $100 shipped on eBay except it enough for $85 shipped on eBay all right Wednesday morning had a couple sales overnight we got 1961 tops Ralph Lamenti sold for $3.99 shipped on eBay uh, Kettle Marte coming off the the, the uh, postseason run here. Except an offer for $40 shipped on eBay on this one. All right, Saturday morning had a couple sales while I was gone this week. Uh, 1980 Tom Seaver tops. Sold that one for $1.99 shipped on eBay. And then the Ken Stabler here had his list for $60 on eBay. Sold it for $47 shipped on eBay. All right, Sunday morning we had a sale here. 2016 Panini Prism Draft Picks. The tie-dye, I think it's numbered to 49 maybe. Uh, Carl Nassib had us listed on eBay for 60, uh, accepted enough for $40 shipped on eBay. All right, last sale of the week here on Sunday. Pete Rose, 1981 Tops Record Breaker. Had us listed for $1.99 shipped on eBay, accepted enough for $1.89 shipped on eBay. All right, Monday night, got our first sale of the week. 1970 catalogs, Gail Sayers, graded CSG9. Had us listed for $65 on eBay, accepted an offer for $55 shipped on eBay. All right, Tuesday morning had a pretty big sale Monday night here. Got the 1954 Red Heart Warren Spawn PSA 8. I just picked this up last week, listed it on Monday, uh, accepted an offer on eBay for $600 shipped uh, Monday night. All right, Wednesday night we got a quick sale here. 1986 Fleer Nolan Ryan sold this for $1.89 shipped on eBay. All right, another sale Wednesday night here. This one sold super quick. I just listed it probably 20 minutes ago. I already sold it. Had it listed for 400 on eBay. Accepted an offer for 360 shipped on eBay. 1950 Bowman, Joe Perry, SGC7 rookie card. All right, Thursday night, I got another quick sale here. 1980 Dale Murphy. Sold it for 325 shipped on eBay. All right, Saturday morning here. We had four sales on Friday. Peyton Manning here, Orange Reactive. Uh, sold for 299 shipped. Powerful Ernie, 1961 tops, sold for $1.99 shipped on eBay. Reggie Smith sold for $1.89 shipped on eBay, 1982 tops traded. And the Sandy Amos rookie uh, had this listed for $50, except an offer for $45 shipped on eBay. All right, Sunday night, wrapping up the week with a few more sales here. You see the, on the bottom here, they got the Charlotte 49ers. Uh, you can see Charlotte 49ers kids basketball jersey sold for $15 shipped on eBay. These two sold to the same buyer, $1.99 each, shipped on eBay to 1960 tops. And then the Willie Mays 1964 tops, 4.5, uh, accepted an offer for 140 shipped on eBay. All right, so tonight we got another sale here. 1966 tops, Hank Aaron. You guys have seen this one in some videos. The one that had the corner damage, uh, accepted an offer for 175 shipped on eBay for this one. All right, Maffer Collectibles here, wrapping up a three-week period, uh, October 16th through November 5th. I, uh, I said I was going to start getting back to bi-weekly. 
some point, hopefully I can, but not this time around. Three week period. Uh, we had 31 eBay sales, just over $2,300. One my slab sale for 40 bucks. Total sales, 2351.86. Card costs, they were a little more expensive this time around. Uh, had some bigger sales, lower profit on those bigger sales. So $1,631 in costs. eBay fees around 325. That one my slab sale there, you can see the fees associated with that. About three bucks between my slabs and uh, PayPal. We had eighty-eight dollars in shipping, and the supplies twelve eighty, which is that thirty-two sales times forty cents, which is your envelopes and things. So total cost just over two thousand bucks for uh, a overall profit for the three-week period of two hundred ninety dollars fifty-one cents, or twelve point three five percent. So again, a little lower this time. I did take some losses on some cards. Um, again, some of those bigger cards. While I may have made 40 or 50 bucks in the card, uh, they were, I think I had a couple cards that sold for three, four, five hundred dollars in that, that three week period. So it wasn't really a big, big gains uh, on those cards as a, from a percentage standpoint. Overall, pretty good though. Uh, I have been listening, trying to list quite a bit more at night and stuff. Work has been crazy, but trying to, uh, to find time to do this every once in a while. So, as always, you guys like the videos, give us a follow, give us a like. Uh, Metro Collectibles on all the platforms, and we will uh, try to keep posting some more stuff here. I want to do a pickups video, pick up some nice, nice vintage stuff for my Hall of Fame collection here that I want to show you guys. And then I, I got a couple reveal, reveal and pre-grade videos to do as well that I'll be doing here in the next couple of weeks. So thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time.